thanks for uh, tuning in. This is uh, my first, how should we say, video log. Seems to be the uh, in thing nowadays. So, a few people's asked me what I do, uh, what I do for a job. People, how can you, you know, have nice cars? Uh, same as anyone, just just work. Uh, just work. Just aim for what you want. Uh, just thought I'd show you about. In my garage now at home. Uh, this is uh, primarily where I work from. So uh, this is my Series One Turbo. Had this a lot of years. Where a lot of people really know me from. Uh, a few people know me, but but knew I blew it up uh, last year, the year before. cars that uh, I've been, myself and Trevor have been doing, uh, been to three different places, couldn't get it sorted, uh, so just fetched it to us, just ran a couple of bodgers, not my cup of tea, this is a friend's Nissan 200SX, we've put all the hydraulic and brake in, ripped all the ABS off etc etc, one of my long term projects, uh, is this 1965 Cortina? A uh, few plans for ST170, set of throttle bodies, put a diff in it, just run it really. Pretty cool car. Uh, show you what we're working on inside. That's my Mark II Escort. Uh, originally was a Pinto injection. We put a Z-Tech in it, had a good laugh, kicked its head in, uh, blew it up, welded everything, uh, now we pulled it to bits, uh, swapped, swapped the engine, that's actually a Duratec now, some 52mm throttle bodies. Uh, the engine bay is done and painted, this is like a grey colour, final colour of a car, a few people have asked but I'm, we think we'll possibly go black. So, uh, roof is very poor, we're just waiting on the new roof skin for it, uh, bodywork is primarily done, just a bit of finishing, uh, then we'll probably get some prime, uh, Ben Ogden has been down here doing a lot of the body work. Fabrication work uh, we've had all done inside it's turreted uh, six linked on coil overs at the rear uh, rear ends obviously still to finish it's still in dolphin which is a really fine filler glaze. Uh, this is the turbo uh, we've got to go on the Series 1, I uh, don't know how I can show you how big it is, that's, that's your general Clifford key fob, so that's a GT3076R, so that's going on the Series 1, uh, it's never had a roller bearing turbo on there, so uh, curious to see how that's going to gonna behave. Uh, this is my other car, a little uh, 1988 1.1 Fiesta. Uh, minute, it's got a set of Gendys and a Z-Tech in there. Uh, I've currently sold this car. Uh, this was one of the reasons when I bought when I bought the Cortina. I knew I had to sell one of them, and unfortunately, fortunately, this was it for me. Uh, a friend of mine's having it, so what I've bought, I'm keeping them throttle bodies to go on the Cortina. Uh, another good friend's having the ECU uh, for his Mark II Escort. So, uh, yeah, uh, this video just really introduced myself, uh, show you around what we're working on. Uh, my next video, probably, we're, we're putting a set of twin 40s on this and a node is. So, I'll, I'll probably run through what's involved with fitting the uh, Webers. 
just to show people that you know it's not rocket science it's pretty easy uh, it's just getting stuck in and, and having a go really uh, but we'll see uh, I've, I've got we have to set fuel in uh, I'll probably run through how to balance the webbers once they're done uh, and we'll see how it behaves also uh, I'm going to be removing a shocker leg on this because I had them rebuilt and uh, yeah one of them's bust again one of the uh, gas coil overs so we'll see how that behaves uh, but yeah just uh, just click like subscribe uh, I'll keep you posted we, uh, where, where we're going with the turbo, what's happening with that. Keep you posted with uh, the progress with the Fiesta, with the uh, Weber conversion. So it, it is going a step back, at, you know, I will admit, going from a set of a throttle bodied car to a set of Webers is going back 20 years. However, Webers, a good set of Webers do still do a fantastic job on a naturally aspirated car. Uh, Plus, like I say, I'm keeping the Webbers for my own car, so the car is going for sale. So it, this isn't really a, an upgrade of a car. It's it's technically, you can class it as a downgrade. However, uh, I want to keep the throttle bodies as top and bottom. So, But yeah, uh, also keep you updated with what's happening with this. Uh, I don't think, I think last time I did anything on it. Put all the alternator belts set up on. Put new alternator. Uh, this is a 2004 crate Juratec. And the gearbox we've actually got mounted in there. Is a, ignore this. This is just what came on a scrap car. This is a six speed from a 2000. 2011 MX-5 so yeah uh, to be honest this is the car I'm most excited about finishing but uh, just waiting on a roof skin so we did start to repair this but it's too far gone so but yeah uh, yeah hit like subscribe uh, that's if you want to see more if you don't if you don't want to listen to me talk bollocks and uh, see what we're on with and uh, don't bother, but yeah, uh, nice to speak to you, and we'll see where we go.